David Cantor with the Cantor Law Group. A lot of times people ask us, well, how do you get custody of a child? Well, what you need to do is file what is known as a petition to establish custody. Now, I'm using the word custody. It's changed in Arizona recently to parenting time, but everybody still calls it custody. Uh, once you establish that, uh, the, the courts will take you through thir certain checklists on what is in the best interest of the child to establish custody. There's also a second issue. Uh, sometimes you have to file a petition to establish paternity. That is what you file first if a child is born out of wedlock. This is obviously for the father. The mother, it's fairly clear that she had the child. So father would have to establish paternity first. Once paternity is established, then you'd go through parenting time or child custody uh, where you go to the judge and you say, look, here's the hours I work, the time I put in, uh, the education, educational needs of the child, the religious needs of the child, and the judge will look at a bunch of factors when de deciding who gets custody and for how long. Now in Arizona, something new happened as of January 1st, 2013. Used to always uh, assume the primary caregiver, which was usually always the mother, had the majority of the time where the dad would get every other weekend. Well, that all changed. Now they're trying for 50-50, regardless of who the primary caregiver is. So that means even though dad's a working dad, if he wishes, he can get 50% custody. And that means he'd obviously have to pick up the kids after school or have daycare arranged, and then he'd come home, be with the kids at night, more responsible for homework, more responsible for activities. But believe it or not, there's a lot of dads out there that are willing to take on more responsibility, as well as a lot of moms. But if this involves you, give us a call and we'll help you out.